Hello everyone. The presentation for today would be about the technology acceptance model. Technology acceptance model is also known as TAM. It was developed by Davis in 1989. It is employed to predict the use and acceptance of information system and technology among the individuals. These are the variables present in TAP. The first variable is perceived usefulness. It is defined as the prospective user's probability that using a specific application system will enhance his or her job or life performance. Basically, perceived of usefulness is a factor that measures how useful an app is to its user. The second variable is perceived ease of use. It is defined as the degree to which the users expect the target system to be free of effort. In other words, it is a variable to indicate how easy for the users to use the apps. The third variable is attitude. It is defined as the user's evaluation of the desirability of employing a particular information system application. Basically, it is the perceptions of the users regarding the app or the system. The fourth variable is behavioral intention. It measures the likelihood of a person employing the app or the system. The last variable is the external variables that can be divided into three factors, which are social factor, cultural factor, and political factor. The first factor is social factors such as language, skills, and facilitating conditions. In other words, how the society or the peers influence a person to use an app or the system. For example, MySpace. Once upon a time, it was famous among the youngsters and was widely used among them. When the society stopped using it and moved to the other apps, MySpace then lost its users. The second factor is the cultural factor, such as the use of apps in certain cultures. For instance, WhatsApp is mostly used among the Malaysian, whereas Kakao Talk is widely used among the Koreans. Meanwhile, Weibo is famous among the Chinese. This shows that different culture is influenced by different apps. And lastly is the political factor that measures the impact of using technology in politics and political crisis. A certain apps are used for political purposes. For example, Facebook is used as a platform for the politicians to influence their supporters. Hi everyone. Now Let's move on to another section where I'm going to show you an example of the use of technology acceptance model or TAM for better understanding about it. Here, I'm going to use a social media called Twitter for instance. So, Twitter will be the actual use or known as AU. In order to test whether people or users are going to use Twitter, we need to test the variables first. The first variable that I'm going to test is perceived usefulness or PU. This is where I'm going to ask questions on how Twitter can be beneficial for them in their lives, whether it is used as entertainment or education. If yes, this variable can influence the attitude of the users or their perceptions towards Twitter. Next, I'm going to test the second variable which is the perceived ease of use. This is where I'm going to ask questions on whether Twitter is easy to use in their daily lives or not. For instance, is it easy for them to find information or entertainment in Twitter? This variable also will influence the attitude of the users, which is the next variable. After we have tested these two variables to influence the attitude of the users, 
these variables will lead to influence the behavioral intention of the users this shows how the attitude of the users on the application such as user will influence their behavioral intention in using those applications lastly the behavioral intention will determine whether users will carry forward their intention into actual use variable as in they will actually using it or not this will be the last results of them in addition perceived usefulness and perceived ease of use can also be influenced by external variables as mentioned before such as social culture and political these variables can be determinants for them as well that's all from me i hope with this explanation will help you get a better understanding about them